Welcome to Addiction 101. My name is John Burke, and what we're doing is we're asking a question each day and providing an answer that we've either gotten from peers or a variety of studies, and we're opening it up to you for your feedback as well. Our question we want to take a look at today is so important. Statistics show and a variety of studies show that over 92% of people that complete a 30-day inpatient treatment program for addiction have a relapse. And a big portion of that happens very quickly upon discharge or treatment. So our question for today simply is, what steps should one take after being discharged from treatment? One of the first primary things that we do with people that we're working with that we refer to treatment centers all over the country is we simply work with them on having A, a 72 hour plan. May have other things like things lined up for outpatient, going to meetings, and all those kinds of things, but very simply the transition from being in treatment where you have doctors, therapists, nurses, a multitude of other peers in a place where there aren't alcohol and drugs available to an instant place where you've left 100% of that support team behind and now you can simply walk into a simple discount store or a gas station and, and be looking at alcohol to buy or, or obviously people out there um, that are free now to purchase drugs if they so wanted to. Having a beginning 72 hour plan, what that does is account for your first three days. Doesn't have to be super, super tight, but accounting for your time and taking responsibility and adhering to that plan, whether it's talking about breakfast, lunch, dinner, and sleep, whether it's talking about possibly returning to work and or going to meetings, that the first three days be very well kind of planned out so that you can simply stick with that plan and make that transition so much more easy. So many times people get out of treatment and immediately within the first 48 hours, they picked up and they don't even know what happened. So one of the primary things would be to have a 72 hour plan of what you're gonna do in those first three days of having them planned out one day at a time is a very good tool to have prior to leaving treatment. My name is John Burke. Addiction 101 is sponsored by InStep Recovery Services. You can contact us at 855-201-2200 if you have any other questions um, or if you have any family members or yourself in need of treatment or detox, we have over 210 facilities located in 37 states that not only accept really great insurance but HMO and we have access to cash pay for as low as $8,000 for detox and 30 days treatment. Please send us your feedback to our Facebook as well and give us any other answers to our question for the day. Thank you and have a great day.